Hello everyone, this is Dan from Design Plus Code and today I'm going to show you how to work with load animations in Sketch. So let's begin. So let's imagine that you need to preview your load animation in a Sketch. For this, I would recommend you to install Anima. Anima is a free plugin available for Sketch and XD and very soon it will support Figma as well. So the first step to install their plugin is to go to their website at animaapp.com. Then scroll all the way to the bottom of the landing page and click on download. On the download page, select the latest version of the plugin. Then to install the plugin, just open the download folder and double click on it. And click OK. OK, let's go to our sketch file. And over there, what we need to do is to create a placeholder. And we will use this placeholder to add our load animation. OK, press R on your keyboard so we can add a rectangle. OK, now let's change the width and height of the rectangle. Like that, we can keep a proportion of the Lodi animation. Let's give 300 to the width and 282 to the height. And then let's center the rectangle. We don't need the borders of the rectangle, so we can uncheck that box. Then on the Anima Settings panel, I can click on the bottom Video Give Lodi. A small pop up will prompt, and over there, you can paste the link of your Lodi animation. For this, we will use Lodi files. Lodi Files is an awesome tool. It has an extensive library of load animations, and their team created all the different Lodi plugins that we use in the most popular design tools. In our case, we will use Lodi Files so we can generate a URL. Like that, we can use that link in our sketch file. Now, let's open our download folder, and we will use a JSON file that I already downloaded from the shape.so library. And from there, let's drag and drop our JSON file. Let's wait for a few seconds, and there you go. Now, we need to copy the link. So let's go to the bottom right, and from there let's click on the copy paste icon. Then let's go back to our sketch file, and paste the link. Make sure that you are selecting autoplay, loop, and no controls, and click on save. Nice. Finally, to preview the animation, let's go to the bottom right of the screen, and over there let's click on the button that says preview in browser. Let's wait for a few seconds. And voila. So these are all the different steps that you need to follow to take your load animation to a sketch. On the description of the video, I will leave all the different links that we use today, as well as the exercise file. So this is the end of the video. If you guys like it, please give us the thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and you can click on the bell icon to be notified of our latest videos. And if you have any comments or questions, please put it in the comment section. I will see you in the next one. Bye.